It's either, it's, it's either veganism or animal abuse. Why would you choose animal abuse? Because uh, God said we're not vegan. God said you're not vegan. Where? In the Bible. Where in the Bible? Genesis. I don't think that's true. I know m many... There's what? Mormons right there. Do you want to talk to them? <laughs> Are you Christian? Yes, I'm Christian. I know plenty of vegan Christians. Yeah, you can be vegan. I'm not saying it's wrong. I'm just saying God said we're, we're meat eaters. But where, where, in the Bible? So it, we'll go grab, grab those mummies and get out but, but when was the Bible written? Because we've evolved since then. We don't need to eat animals. Years ago. Yeah, okay. So maybe during that time it was necessary to eat animals, right? For survival. But now we can Change is necessary. Based. I believe in that. Yeah. Change is necessary. Yeah. But we're going back on. If you're a true believer in God, we go back and revert to the real way. But do you think yeah. God condones what happens in a slaughterhouse? I can't speak for God. God is on a higher plane than But that. you were just saying that God said this and that. So I believe think, in what God you... says. Okay. I'm not saying what he says is true or not. Right. So if, if God and the devil were in a room together with a baby lamb, who would slit the baby's lamb, baby lamb's throat? So if you want to go in that context, what do you know is good and what is bad? Just being a human, what is good and what is bad? I know animal abuse is bad. So I agree with you on that. But what happens in a slaughterhouse is I animal abuse. I believe in killing is bad, regardless if it's an animal, if it's a person, or anything like that. So why aren't you vegan then? Why you am I vegan? I just told you from the start. God told me that we're, we're eating um, you know, meat. That's fine. It's fine. But you don't have to. You can be a vegan Christian, right? Yeah, your question to me though, yeah? What was your question? What was your question to me? Um, my first one, I think I said, why aren't you having a vegan Christmas? And, and then I, I told you that I eat meat, yeah? Yeah. yeah. And then you asked me why, mm. and I said that because God said it. Right. I didn't say nothing about, I don't like vegans or whatever like that, yeah? No, no, I'm not getting that impression, but I'm just saying you can be a vegan Christian, right? So why would you choose animal abuse, rape and murder when you could be vegan? Rape? What's rape got to do with that? Well, most animals in the meat, dairy, and egg industries and other animal industries no, actually rape and forcibly bred into still. existence. No, I mean, you're talking the, about rape, man. The, the dairy, in the dairy industry, for example, they rape the mothers to impregnate them, so she starts producing milk, that, that's right? Facts. That's and then facts. they that's take facts. the baby away from her. I don't know her. about rape, but that's facts. You gotta have like you know uh, X chromosome and a Y chromosome to make uh, something. Yeah. So, so what happens is they use an electro ejaculator for the bulls to collect his semen in the dairy industry. The farmer shoves their fist into her anus and puts the bull semen into her vagina via a metal rod to forcibly impregnate her. The industry actually confines her in what they call a rape rack. And then after a nine month pregnancy, when she gives birth, her babies are taken away from her so humans can have and steal her milk. And the male calves are shot in the head. Would you say that's wrong? No, I believe killing is bad. Yeah, God told me killing is bad. And regardless if it's a human or it's an animal, even if it's an ant or a bird or whatever. Sounds like God wants you to be vegan then. No, it doesn't. Killing's wrong. It doesn't though. God but never you, told but, me to be a vegan. But every moment you God choose not to be, to be vegan, vegan, you are killing animals. You're murdering them. No, nah, God never told me to be a vegan. Yeah? That's the difference. But you're, the you're using God as a justification to yeah, murder animals, slit God? their throats. Do you believe in God though? No, then I don't. you can't relate to me then, and I can't relate to you. That's different. You but gotta, you just said you you're against animal world. abuse. You got, yeah, I'm against it. But I you're paying for animal I abuse. I know what's right and I know what's wrong. But you're paying for animal I'm abuse. I'm talking about killing. Yeah, yeah, you're paying for animal abuse nah, you're and killing. A, you're putting something into it. Yeah? Someone's dead body killing. is on your plate, right? Killing. That's killing. All right, so if you kill an animal and you kill a person, what weighs more than to you, yeah? An animal or a person? Please, tell me. Animals are people. Uh, no, they're not people. They're yeah, not they, people. They, they, can they talk? Beings. Can they talk? Yes, they communicate like with each other. Animal. They don't. I can no, tell you but, right now. They but we're don't. all they animals. Don't. We're all animals, they're sentient beings, you, and most oh, importantly, go, they want to live. The evolution chart. They feel yeah, pain no, and suffering. I don't go with that. But you I'll said you're Adam against killing. I'll go with Adam, Adam and the, Eve, yeah? The garden of Adam and Eve was vegan. No, there was the no killing, there's no, sla there was no was slaughterhouses. Eden. Not Adam and Eve, it was even. You don't know your Bible, you don't know any religion, yeah? Yeah, but you're so using you religion speak, as a justification to abuse and murder animals. Tash. Mikey. My actual name is Mikaele. Yeah. You're a good person, I love your personality, I love what Thank you're doing you. right here. Thank you. But, to be honest, I'm just being speaking facts here. 
I love what you're doing here. How are you speaking facts? You said you're against killing, but you're paying for animals to be forced into yeah, slaughterhouses. That, that, and I just me, told you what happens in the facts, dairy industry. My facts. You don't believe in my facts. Yeah. So I'm still speaking facts. You just don't believe my okay. facts. What are your facts? I go with the Bible. What yeah. the Bible tells me. Yeah. The Bible was written 4,000 years ago. You don't believe that. You don't know what happened 4,000 years ago. All you know is what happened back then and what, what's All happening I know now. is what's happening now is yeah, the largest you, holocaust in history. Three trillion animals are brutally murdered every you year. Three trillion. No, I believe, I, 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 let me put this in. Like what you're doing right now, all gravy, all good. You'll probably change a lot of people to become vegans and that, yeah? But Why when not you, you come when you come across someone that's religious, it's a different story, okay? So religious people are allowed to abuse and murder animals. Are they the ones that do oh, I never said that to you? You're, no, but you're paying people to abuse paying and murder them. animals every time you eat meat, dairy and eggs. So there's a different there's a different question you need to ask me. Do I buy stuff from the store? Do I buy stuff from there? You never asked me that. It doesn't matter where it's bought from. You said you're not vegan, which means you consume animal flesh, dairy and eggs, right? Am I so correct? I can eat chicken, right? Do I know where that fucking chicken came from? Do you? No, I don't. I eat chicken. They were they were raised yeah, in a factory farm where they suffered, something. and you're then they were sent to us. I've been to the slaughterhouses and farms. I actually know where your your sorry, flesh came I'm from. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Where did my flesh come from? Because I know where it came from. It came from the dirt. That's what the Bible said. Yeah, but that chicken was yeah, forced into a slaughterhouse. That, they were shackled yeah, yeah. by the feet. Then they had their throat yeah, slit. You don't believe in that? I came from the dirt. You believe that chickens were slaughtered and that? That's fair. How come you can't believe what I'm believing and I can believe what you're believing? When did I say I'm not believing you? I'm actually questioning you. So do you believe you. I came from the dirt? I'm not sure. Don't say that out of conscience. I'm not sure, but I'm not saying I don't yeah, believe you. So I'm here to talk about animal rights. That's the same thing with me. Yeah, you're saying that, yeah, you're, you said you've been to a slaughterhouse. I have never been to a slaughterhouse. Same yeah, thing maybe as you said, should go. you read the Bible. You should what? read the Bible then. Read the Bible. I went to a Catholic school. I have read Catholic the Bible. Catholic is not religion. They're what do you mean? Religion. Catholic. But I read, I read the Bible in school. But that has nothing to do with our yeah, topic. Does, We're talking about animals being does. abused and murdered. Yeah, that's what you're talking about. I just told you that dairy that's cows are raped about. and their Tash, babies are taken away from about, them. You're talking about that. And yeah. I'm telling you, I'm talking about this. What do you want me to listen to? Your thing or my thing? Well, I'm trying to tell you that you said your you're against right killing animals. Your camera looking at us right now. Yeah. Peace. Is this going on YouTube or whatever? Yeah, if you're okay with that. Oh, yeah, I'm quite okay with everything. Okay, cool. So what I'm speaking Thank is you. facts, but like still... Yeah. Like, I respect what you're doing here, yeah? It's just the people that you approach. Mm. Some of them have a strong belief in religion, yeah? I understand, but, but religion be. is no but excuse to abuse animals. Yeah, but you can't change someone that if they're really strong in religion, you can't change them. You can probably change someone that doesn't believe but in religion. But I know plenty of religious vegans, whether they're Muslim, Christian, Catholic, uh, Jewish, there are so many vegans. So why aren't you vegan? What's stopping you? So if I eat that grass right there, I'm vegan? No, veganism... If I eat eggs, anything that comes out of a chicken, I'm vegan? No, that's not vegan, because so, that's animal exploitation. So eggs is not meat? Wait, let's just establish what veganism means. What do you think veganism is? Anything plant-related, that's what I know. No, that's all I know. No, no, it's an ethical view against animal cruelty and exploitation. So that means Can vegans Can I bring my boys into this? Because, yeah. wait man, you guys are fuck, man. Sorry. Yeah. Can you uh, bleep that? <laughs> <laughs> we will believe Hi, that. Hi man, meet Tash. Tash, this is Benny, this is my brother. Hey, nice, nice to meet, you. Nice meet you. And this is Jay, this is my other brother. Hey, nice, nice to meet you. This is Tash. Yeah? I love your work, I love your work. Thank nah. you. Yeah, see, we all respect you. vegans. We, respect yeah, that, we, we all respect, respect that, the respect movement that. and all that, yeah? Yeah, 100%. Yeah, so why are you, are you a part of the movement? Me, I'm religion, yeah, you should know that, yeah? yeah. I'm religious, yeah? So They're you respect religious. veganism, but you are going against veganism by paying for animals to be forced into slaughterhouses. I, I never said that. No, you're but no, that's what change. you're doing. You're telling me to change. That's what you're telling me. I'm trying to make you realize that if you're against animal oh, abuse and killing, you, killing, then you should better. align your morals with your actions by nah, living vegan. I align my morals. I like no, Tash, Tash. Yeah, Hey man, the camera's right there, man. Speak to the camera. Speak on it, speak on it, speak on it, speak on it. We had a good conversation, we had a good conversation. This is the only time Tash can talk to us, and that's probably the longest that you've ever talked to anyone. 
<laughs> Honestly, you just got some confidence. Come on, tell, tell me what you think. I'm, I don't mind, I'm, it's, it's, I'm listening. It's not that easy to just make that transition to just stop. No, what she's trying to say, Solo, is why, that why? cut it all out. No, she's I mean? trying to make, you said realise, yeah? Realise that vegan, vegan is the way to go and killing you know, animals and stuff, but that's bad. Yeah. No, and I agree. To me, 100%. yeah, you agree, you agree. I agree. Yeah. Look, I'm, I agree. I'm saying, I believe it's a moral obligation yeah. to do it straight away once you know the truth. For me, I went vegan immediately yeah. after watching a documentary, but obviously it's a learning journey, right? But yeah. I think once you learn the truth, you are morally obligated to stop paying for animals to be raped, enslaved, tortured, abused and murdered because that's exactly what happens in the meat, dairy and egg industries and beyond the leather, wool, fur, animal entertainment and racing industries. We don't need to be using them as commodities and objects. 100%. Tash, I was with you from the start. You just tried to change me, but you said... <laughs> <laughs> no, no, for real! I man, she said... I man, she said... She says she wants me to realise. I said, yeah, I already know. I realise, yeah? Yeah. It's just you're not going to change me to become a vegan, but I know that's bad. That's it. That's all I'm saying. You know it's bad. What, to not be vegan? No. It's what? killing animals. That's what you said. I, yeah. Yeah. So becoming if you know it's bad, then yeah, so why not be vegan? Is becoming a vegan or just realising that killing animals is bad? Or do you want both? Well, they both come hand in hand, yeah, right? Because you if both. you're not vegan, you're paying for animals to be killed on your behalf. You want both. So you want change, that's what you want. Change. It takes a long time, baby, to It does, to change, but it man. all starts with you as an individual. So what's stopping you from so changing and becoming vegan? That's why I respect you come out in an open place like this and talk to people about stuff. Yeah. Respect, because your words will probably touch someone here. You'll why probably not touch you? You're, you're, no, you you see... touch me with your presence. Straight up, you touch me with your presence. You can touch anyone here. By the next day, they'll probably change. Yeah. Five years from now, they'll probably change. But it's because of your impact right now, in this conversation that you have with people, it will change them. Yeah. But you can't expect them to change. So what I'm trying to tell you is that when you approach people, yeah, talk about it, 100%. But even yeah. listen. Listen is a big factor into every communication kind of thing. Listen to what they say and know your aim. Your aim is to, what I got from you is change and realize. I thought you tried to change me straight away, and then you said realize. I already realize. So changing, and when you're saying change, it'll take me a while for change, yeah. Because I go with my religion. That's it. That's what I'm trying to tell you. Religion. People that are stuck in religion. Sure. Just be careful. Of, like what you not be careful what you say. Speak your mind, because the world's changed now. You can speak your mind right now. You can. Yeah. People get dumb for saying the word gay. You know what I mean? So, um, can I can I ask you one more question? If you were in the animal's position, an animal about to be forced into a slaughterhouse and have their throat slit, what would you want your oppressor to do? Would you want them to be vegan? If I was an animal and I knew as an animal that I had oppressors, now nah, think about that question real quick. If I was an animal, you don't know what an animal thinks, yeah? They just know that a normal cycle the triangle. But what do you think they? Are. What do you think they think and I feel when they're in a they slaughterhouse? Think, I don't know what they think. Well, I think you should watch slaughterhouse footage because it's know, very clear any, that they're terrified there and they want to live. Is there any statistics or any data or information about what they think? Yeah, there is. There's, is there? there's a lot. Yeah. Please there's, email there's, me. I'll give you my socials or whatever. Sure. Or, the, yeah, please email me the statistics, and I'll think about it. Okay. Well, there's always new evidence emerging every day about different species of animals, but what is confirmed is that they're sentient beings. They feel pain and suffering and they feel joy and happiness. And they're absolutely terrified when they go into those slaughterhouses. I've been to these slaughterhouses just around here and I've heard pigs screaming as they burn from the inside out in gas chambers. I'm about to go to a BHP you can't tell me that. Yo, you can't tell me that before. Yo, I put this are they gone? Do you need to go? Uh, no, 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 let me go. Nah, this is important to you, so it's important to me. because I, I understand you need so to go. I can leave you nah, with my contact and nice. I can forward yeah, you 100%. information. And my name... You are on YouTube, yeah? Yes. So you can just search, just add my name now and then you can search on social media. Tash Peterson. Or I'll just text me and I'll just send you all the information. Yes, yep, that's it.
All right. Well, What's I your really. Organization? Oh, I, um, I like to put it under. I, well, I'm an animal rights activist, so I'm not under any organisation. I just do animal so, rights oh, activism. Are you doing this for? I'm just uh, like an individual animal rights activist. I so I just the I do I protesting the and conversations with people. Animals. Yeah. So you don't have colleagues in that? No. I respect your grind, honestly. I Thank respect you. that. Thank that you very is, much. That is crazy, man. Thank you. To and see I, that I, you're not even with the company or whatever, man. That's yeah. crazy. Oh. To well, thank honest, you. I really appreciate I hope the you conversation. Touch someone here. You touch yeah. me, of course, but. Okay. Thank you. I'm religious. That's all. That's yeah. all I can say. Be like, I'm, I'm religious, straight up. Wow. All right. Well, please, I'll send you all the information. But the most important thing you can do is watch, watch yeah, Dominion. Can I give you some tips, though? I don't think that will join you on there. What? This? Why not? I don't know, you're putting Xmas into this. You know what Xmas means? What? I don't know. Why did you put Xmas there and not Christmas? Because it's short. Because it's, I couldn't fit Christmas in. Well, I mean, maybe. <coughs> yeah. I couldn't fit it in. Xmas, that means in Hebrew, that word right there means slaughter. But yeah, I really? don't think you knew that. But no, I good. didn't. Put Thanks. That there. Thank you for letting me know. Right there, I don't think you'll attract anyone. Murder. I'm not trying to attract people, I'm trying to confront people and tell them the truth. Yeah, that's if they stop here and talk to you. Yeah. I mean, you're attractive, you've got a reindeer suit on, but yeah. I don't think yeah. people will stop you. Oh, plenty. If they no. see murder. Vegan, yeah. But people need to see the truth because animals are murdered. Sorry, it's just a good, fact. You're doing a good thing, I never said it was bad, I'm just saying. Yeah. Sure. You'll, all right. Well, I appreciate I the conversation yeah, so sometimes. much, and I'll send you all that information. And I hope you enjoy your night and find your friends wherever you they. Left, man. That okay. is crazy. To me. Yeah. Well, thank you very much, yeah. Tess. Thank you. Keep up the good work, yeah? Thank you.